Uh, hi everyone. Uh, today I will talk about a component in the EFOMES about how help you to record the data during the design optimization process. Uh, the 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 purpose of this uh, component is to help you to record the data other than the fitness value uh, of each design variance generated during the design optimization process. Uh, because we recommended you using the single object function, so in most cases you will use like a waste of function to formulate the fitness value. So uh, after after you analyze, uh, after the optimization process finish, you want you may want to analyze the data of each of the desired variant generated, or any one of the desired variant generated during the design optimization process. At that time, you can. Uh, use this uh, value to analyze uh, the the specific number of each of the factor you uh, combining into the fitness uh, fitness value. So, uh, for example, if you are using uh, a with a function to uh, to generate a fitness uh, value uh, combining the floor uh, gross uh, floor area and the sub, uh, the surface uh, facade surface area. So you using this function, you can see uh, the specific value of the cross area and the surface area. So the component is very easy to use. You can find the component here and can draw into canvas. And then you will right click the com uh, component, you will find these two options and you can generate uh, the two uh, pa uh, panel to tell the component where you want to uh, store the 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 the, the file to recording the value. So when you're using this uh, component, firstly you have to save your uh, organization process project into uh, some place in your computer, and so they can detect the the directory of the place uh, you uh, save your uh, GH file. So for the uh, and you can see here have some inputs. Uh, the first, uh, the third one is the variable. Variable uh, you don't need to connect it when you're using the evil mesh because there will be no uh, exposed uh, number you can see uh, generated by the optimization solver. But uh, actually, the recorder can be used in different types of the optimization or algorithm or solver in the Rhino grasshopper, such as the uh, Galapago, but uh, when you're using Galapago, there will be uh, uh, you know the the gene pool. So you can uh, connect your gene pool here to record the variable to generate each of the design. But in the Euro mess, you don't necessarily do you, you don't need to do that. Uh, the third four one is the physics function uh, physics value. So in here we are using the example uh, case that we will. Uh, how to say to use this uh, visa function to combine the gross uh, floor uh, gross floor area and the uh, facade surface area, and you can just connect it into here. And when you connect it here, you will find uh, this uh, XML uh, file in your computer. And here, you, this this component also will generate a folder to com to contain the image. Uh, captured during the design optimization process. And the other is the uh, each of the more specific number you want to uh, record. Uh, for example, we will recall the cross of the cross floor area here and also the surface facade area here and we'll put it into here and if have a warming because you have a given a name to uh, tell tell the component to indicate each of the number you input so you can use a panel here and you to uh, write the thing you want to you want to indicate the the number you we are you are recording and here you will oh sorry so it should be like this one. Uh, this will be the correct one. And you can also check the number, check the output here. You can see 
the floor area is uh, this value and the facade area is this value. And after you come back, you can find uh, this value is also already recording in this XML file. And here the uh, last two one is to, you have to tell the uh, this component you are, uh, the automation is going maximum or going the minimum. So uh, they will capture the screen during the new improvement solution uh, found during the design automation process. And here is also the, uh, And here you can also find the recall option is that if you are turn this into the force, they will only recall the value of the improve, uh, improvement solution. If it if you are turned into a true, they will recall all the uh, desired variant, uh, the, the value of the desired variant during the desired automation process. So before you running the automation, you have to uh, delete this uh, XML file. And here you can check whether there are some image already captured during or in the last design optimization process, and you can just delete it. And so here we will run the optimization to see how this can help you to uh, record the number during the optimization. All right, let's run the optimization. And once you start running the automation, you can find they are already uh, captured the screen to uh, when each of the improvement solution uh, found. And you can also find this uh, XNL file is uh, recording each of the desired variant during the automation process. And they will update it each uh, of the generation. So I won't run the organization uh, to the stop. So we just stop here and just let you to see how this component can help you to recall all the data you want to know during your organization process. And you can see here is the screen catcher. All right, this is the today's uh, video about this uh, recording component. I hope you can, uh, I hope this can help you in your design optimization. Uh, that's it. Thank you. Goodbye.